Today we will be taking you through the first time setup of a Loop 2 drill monitor. This includes three pieces of information that must be changed in the monitor for your drill monitor to work properly. The first piece is the implement width. The second piece is the row spacing of the machine. And the third piece is what type of machine it is, whether it's a drill or an air seeder. So to change these settings, simply hit the menu button. Comes to the setting menu. Hit the down arrow key one time to implement setup and hit select. Implement with is the second one down, so hit the down arrow key once. Hit the select button to highlight the number of feet. And press and hold the up or down arrow key until you get to the appropriate number of feet for your machine. Once you get to the appropriate number of feet, hit the select button. And then hit the down arrow key to exit and save and hit select. The other two pieces of information that need to be changed are found in the seed settings menu. Scroll down to seed settings, hit select. Row spacing is the third one down. Hit the down arrow key till row spacing is highlighted. Hit the select button and then use the up or down arrow keys until you get to the desired inches. When done, hit the select button again and it goes automatically to machine type, drill. If this is correct, leave it alone. If it is not, hit the select button so that drill is highlighted and hit the up or down arrow key to get to the appropriate implement type. There are two types available for air seeders, air seeder at low rate, which would be seed count less than 500,000 seeds an acre, and there's air seeder high rate, which would be any counts above 500,000 seeds an acre. All conventional drill or gravity fed drills will be set on regular drill setting. Once that setting is set appropriately, hit the select key, hit the down arrow key one time to exit and save, and hit the select button. And now your initial setup is done and you are ready for a speed calibration.